Welcome hockey fans, Chris Jensen here with another episode of Blades of Steel where we look back at all the legendary hockey players around the world, well known or not well known. Today we'll be talking about Cody McLeod, the lesser known bruiser for the AHL. Here's Robert. Thanks Chris. Cody McLeod did play for the Lowell Lock Monsters for only two months, but although he did make his presence known on the ice, eventually getting kicked out of the league because of he put his elbow through the chest cavity of a referee. Let's check up on him now. Hey Cody, thanks for having me. Oh, no problem coach. I'm not your coach. Your nickname is the Merc. How and why did you get that nickname? Uh, back in 73, I really injured this guy, so the name just kind of stuck. So I've heard you've had a tough time, you know, getting the game out of your system. Is that true? Uh, yeah, I'd have to say that it is true. I mean, I have to go to therapy about it like two times a week. But lately I just had to face it. I'm a player. And I said, screw therapy. I'm just going to continue on with my mission. My mission of destruction. Does that mission of destruction include you body checking and maiming innocent people? I mean, we've heard stories about you openly hitting the elderly, small children, pregnant women, Vietnam veterans. Is this true? Well, you know what? I uh, bleed hockey 24-7, 365, 366 on leap years. You know, if those people that you say that I hit, they come to my personal space, I don't care who you are, you're gonna get wrecked. Okay? That's the bottom line. That's all there is to it. That's all I gotta say. ESPN camera crews went out with Cody McLeod for one day to see what his lifestyle was really all about. Let's show some of that footage. Dig deep. Let's go, Cody. Come on. One more. Come on! You can do it, Mark! Mark! <laughs> oh, good work, Mark. Oh, back in 73, I really injured this one guy and the guy in the other team. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> no, you're supposed to get paid. I know, but I was going to build up to that. What are the boys coming to that? It's like I'm a merc. I, get, get, get the name. <laughs> I really heard this boy. one guy. The other guy said, hey, quit mercing him. So your nickname is the merc. How and why did you get that nickname? Uh, back in 73, I really injured this guy. And it's uh, the right defensive man. He's like, hey, quit murking that guy. I was like, <laughs> 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 I just say screw it, and I continue with my method. <laughs> hey. So you're asking, is this true? That I'm hitting babies. Hey! <laughs> 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 There's a baby over there. Can you see that in there? What the mic? The football? It's not football. It's a game mic football. <laughs> Please don't put your head on it. Because that is not me. No way would I hit Vietnam vets, God bless America, and old ladies, and small babies, maybe big babies too. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Do it! Don't eat the food! I have Nick come to the door like, Nick, I'm just going to come out of here and just narrow into the car. I'm not going to run away from a baby. I try and save it. Save the baby. Save this guy. And it's uh, the right defensive man. He's like, hey, quit murking that guy. And I was like, <laughs> 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 the right defensive man. <laughs>